for who I am. She'll only ever see me for who I'm not. Pat. Whom, by the way, I did not kill. How could you have stood by all these years and watched Charlene be with other men? Oh, I had my chance. But I didn't act. I was just so caught up in my fear of getting hurt that I couldn't see what I was losing. And now? It's just too late. Should have called a long time ago. You know, I, I meant to. I, I, I don't even know what to say. I'm sorry. I know I destroyed your life. Nate, a 24 year old meth addict destroyed my life. You were the good guy. Is that why you're in Alaska? Oh, God, you're an idiot. Get your ass out of the tundra and come home. You want to work off your guilt? Come paint my house. Yeah, sure. Not if you're still thinking of painting it that puke green. Okay, are you dissing my style? Dissing it 3,000 miles away. <laughs> oh, speaking of style, you know who I saw last week? Carmichael. Who's that? Remember that skinny little flight school? <laughs> really? He is now the size of camping yards. <laughs> hey, boys. What's that? Moose. Can't find us for hunting, Chief. I wasn't going to, but you're blocking the intersection. Move the truck. Chaco. I heard that. Okay, settle down. It's okay. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, is that a kiss? Is that what you're doing? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Mmm. <laughs> You're just a big softie after all. I leave you guys alone for a couple of days, and this is what happens? Oh, wow. You're home early. Hey, cutie. <laughs> Get out of here. Get some fresh air. Give me a whack at him. Hi. Oh, I would surprise you. Well, I am glad. I missed you. I brought you a present. You brought me a present? Mm -hmm. What'd you bring me? Wow. Wow, look at these. Hey, don't mock my booty call. No, I'm not. I mean, you know, these aren't boots. These are you saying that you want me around for a long, long time. Maybe. You're good. Then marry me. Uh, I knew it. I just knew it. You give a guy good sex and a hot meal, and now he's asking you to marry him. I love you. Don't you think marriage just might screw that up? I love you. Damn it, I love you, too. Something's got rocky. Oh, Meg, what are you doing? Protecting my dog. Right, give me the gun. You've got your own gun. Get back! 
Someone baited this bear to come here with moose meat. Whoever it was knew that Rocky would corner that bear. And if Rocky was cornered, then... Then you'd go after him. No. I wasn't supposed to be here. Who knows you carry a 9 millimeter? The whole town? Exactly. With that kind of gun, an enraged bear would have ripped you apart. Someone was counting on that. something I want to say. Okay. Ever since Dad left, I, uh... Just say it, Peggy. I always thought that if he'd loved me enough, he would have come back. Oh, baby. I turned that blame on you. I blamed you for me being alone, for him leaving. What I've realized recently is that you could have left, but you didn't. You stayed. You gave me this town as a family. I've never really been alone. Um, you know, Nate asked me to marry him. What did you say? I, uh... I guess I, I didn't. Well, you didn't answer him? <laughs> I was going to. I just didn't uh, have a chance. Do you love him? Yes. Then marry him and hold on to that feeling for the rest of your life. Hold on to it hard. I'll try. <laughs> you know, all I ever wanted for you was to be happy. Why can't you want the same thing for yourself? John is moving away. I know. Mom, he loves you. He's a good guy. He'd do absolutely anything for you. That's something. But is it enough? I guess that's up to you. Yeah? Nate? Just a sec. Meg told me the good news. I'm <laughs> so happy for both of you. And if you break her heart, I'll kill you. Oh, well, thanks for the warning. I'm not kidding. <laughs> <laughs> OK. OK. Hey, Charlene, I know you and Pat fought before he left, but he would have come back. When you do what I do, you get to know a victim, sometimes a lot better than the people who knew him living. And Pat would have come back. Thank you. That's the nicest thing anyone's ever said to me, especially someone who's not trying to get in my pants. <laughs> <laughs> OK. Uh, you're funny. Fine, thank you. <clears throat> Time. I know. Oh, hey, Nate. Hey. Yes, I know. I've been hearing all over town myself. I think you're overreacting. Yeah, meeting. Yeah, I'll talk to him. Okay, good. I'll be right back.